Today, a neighborhood summit was held in Sioux Falls. Here's a look at how it happened, why it happened, what was discussed, and what deten attendees had to say. Nancy Tapkin of Sioux Falls explains that she's here to be in the know. I am part of the Terrace Park Neighborhood Association. We've just crossed a five-year mark. So for me, it's really about uh, staying in the loop. Like, I want to be in the flow. I want to know who the people are in a position to help our neighborhood. So really about being informed, you know, showing myself new ideas of other neighborhood associations. For Mitchell Onstad of Sioux Falls, it's about resources. There's a lot of resources out there for us as a community that uh, we don't take full advantage of. And so I'm hoping to learn a little bit more about those resources. A number of topics came up during this neighborhood summit, including neighborhood watches, national night out, code enforcement, lighting, speeding, and housing. It's really important for the, the residents of Sioux Falls to be engaged with, um, with the city to make sure that we are listening to what their concerns are. Um, certainly having strong neighborhoods builds a much stronger city, and we all want that. We want people to know each other. The purpose of this meeting was to, was to begin an ongoing dialogue with those parts of the neighborhoods that are organized. Okay. Because we want to work with our neighborhoods, and so we want to identify those leaders and those people who are willing to become leaders. Onstead is already looking ahead to the future. And I would like to see you know, more young people showing up to really show an effort, but really I, I think it's just that a lot of us didn't know, didn't know about it. Tapkin also brings up numbers. Neighborhood associations should keep at it. And if you don't already have one, I really highly encourage you to start one. It's a really good way to have your voice heard. One person complaining all the time is a lot different than 20 people coming together for a common cause. So really a better way to make your voice heard. The City of Sioux Falls' website has a section on neighborhood associations. You'll be able to find a link to it in this story at kelloland.com.